What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to have a look at one of the latest Apple Watch Series 6 clones out there on the market to purchase. Now this is the HW22 Pro, basically the updated version of the HW22 smartwatch. This is a Apple Watch Series 6 clone. We're really excited to check these out. Now there are many models out there on the market to purchase. There's like over 20 to 50 models of the apple watch series 6 clone without any further ado let's check these out um like always i'll drop a link down description where you guys can check these out these are gonna cost approximately only one tenth of the original price from apple so the apple watch series 6 from apple is gonna cost around 399 usd dollars if i'm correct but the ones from aliexpress the hw22 pro is going to cost approximately 30 dollars now there are different colors they can choose from and you can see that we got different colors like the silver but they call it the white model the black the red the blue and the pink so you basically have five options to choose from now this is going to cost approximately 30 dollars but if you do add an extra watch band which is basically they call the silver steel watch brand on the apple's website is actually called the milanese watch band which comes with the stainless steel watch so here is basically the extra watch band that you can get for an extra dollar or two which is pretty good deal so i did pick up two colors the blue and the red now when it comes to features of the watch there's plenty of features which I'm going to quickly talk about them. So first of all, the display is going to be approximately a 1.75 inch display and there are many features on the watch. So you can make phone calls or receive phone calls within the watch when you're connected to Bluetooth to your phone. You can also verify your heart rate, your blood pressure, your body temperature, your oxygen level. But obviously, this is not going to be as accurate as Apple. So if you're someone who's trying to find an affordable smartwatch for medical reasons, I would say go with the real Apple. Apple Watch Series 6 or the Apple Watch SE and not an Apple Watch clone because these are not going to be as accurate as Apple's real original Apple Watches. So yeah, let's check these out, see how good it is going to be. Now, first of all, once again, this is one tenth of the original price. So don't expect to be as good as original ones, especially when it comes to the packaging. So on the front of the box, you are going to see that we got different watch faces and these watch faces are going to be pre-installed on the watch. So that's pretty cool. You can also get custom watch faces from google you can download an image save it on your camera roll and then upload it on the watch you can also take a picture of yourself now as you can see the box is pretty average um, we do not have any apple brandings or any apple logos on the side we do have the blue sticker and then for this one we do have the red sticker which tells you which color the watch is and then on the side it says series 6 space aluminum case 44 millimeter same thing for this one and then other side is blank and then once again it repeats the same thing and then on the bottom it tells you what's included in the box a smartwatch a band a charging case and a user manual and that's it so let's check these out let's check out the red model really easy to open the box simply shake it a little bit and then remove the cover and the first thing you'll see once you open the box of course is the user manual it's gonna say sports smartwatch display never sleeps and it shows you the five different colors that you can get and then on the second page it tells you the instructions on how to use the watch and finally we've got the features available on this watch and on the other side it's going to be in chinese so inside the box the first thing you'll see on the left side is the watch itself the hw22 pro wrapped in a plastic to avoid it from being scratched while shipping and of course we got a sports band a silicone sports band and red and finally in the box you are going to have a charging cable it is a wireless charging cable as you can see it does not have any charging pins now here is a close look of the watch wrapped in a plastic really easy to be removed simply pull this little tab and here it is there we go we've got the watch itself now as you can see we do have a pre-installed screen protector it's not the highest quality which you can remove it if you want so on the side right here we do have the digital crown which actually turns and we also have the microphone at the same position as the real ones and finally the power button here we've got the sports band where you can actually attach to it and finally we do have the speakers 
the back of the watch, you will have the sensors to verify your heart rate, your blood pressure, your body temperature. And of course, we have engravings around of the watch. So it says watch without the Apple logo due to copyright. Then series 6, 44, aluminum and ceramic case. And then it says Ion X glass bluetooth coder it's really easy to install the watch band uh, just like the original ones pretty simple quality of the watch band is decent quality not the highest quality like the ones provided by apple and it's not also the cheapest it's a pretty decent quality watch band uh, so that's pretty cool simply install it like this there we go here is the watch and here is the apple watch series 6 the hw22 pro in blue color pretty great design i did install my own watch band as you can tell so here's a close look of the watch as you can see it is very beautiful pretty much a one-to-one -to, -one to the original ones when it comes to the physical look really great color well balanced and this is actually made of aluminum it's not made of plastic so that's pretty High quality does have a really nice weight to it so let's turn on the watch it is very simple all you have to do is simply hold the power button for a few seconds and then you'll see a hello on the display and it actually hear sound from the speakers as you can see so the first thing is gonna prompt up once you turn this on is the language there are many different languages as you can see right here to choose from so for this video we are going to pick the English tap in English and right away it brings you to the home screen with the different watch faces so as you can see it is a pretty beautiful display now one thing about the display is that it is actually an LCD display and actually looks pretty decent it does not have an OLED display due to its cost so if you do tap on the power button it turns on the watch once again it basically shuts down the watch and if you turn the digital crown you'll be able to switch between the watch faces if i'm correct there's a total of 41 watch faces on this watch so i'm just going to quickly show it to you guys and as you can see we do have some animated watch faces which is pretty cool with the date the battery the day of the week sometimes even um the footsteps that you've done while working out so that's pretty cool there's around 41 watch faces. You can actually install others watch faces from the app available um, from the App Store or from the Google Play Store. Or you can even take a picture of yourself or your pet or an image from Google. I'm going to pick this one to just show you guys the display. You can actually read what is on the display. It's pretty clear. It does have a pretty high resolution. So if you swipe from the top, as you can see, we do have a similar design like the original ones so the first one's basically the motion sensor you turn your wrist to turn on the display shake the device to answer phone calls and here is the main menu style we do have the smart style which is basically tap once on the display as you can see we do have the smart style and there's this different styles they can choose from this crown actually works and you can actually zoom in and zoom out to return to the home screen, so we press once on the digital crown, and then you can return right here. Change the main menu style to whatever you want. So let's go with the first one. Tap once again, and as you can see, we got a different design. If you swipe from the bottom, this is basically your notification center. Since it's not connected to my phone, it's not gonna work. If I swipe from the right, there's a split screen. I can actually set up a passcode on the watch. So tap on the lock, turn it on. I'm going to set one, two, three, four. I have no access to watch. I actually have to press one, two, three, four to unlock the watch, as you can see. So you can go to the app store and download an app called RD Fit. This is going to be the application that would synchronize the watch to your phone to receive notifications and to use some of the features. To connect the watch to your phone, it's really simple. All you have to do is simply go to the Bluetooth menu from the watch and then tap on search new device. As you can see, it currently says that it is searching. It says iPhone, which is basically my phone. Tap on it and then it is currently pairing. Now on my phone, I'm going to receive a pop-up asking if I would authorize this um, Bluetooth connection device. Tap on pair. And as you can tell, it says watch six connected. 
in here and she tells me that it is connected to the watch now the other thing you have to do is go in the app itself which is downloaded on your device open it up and on the bottom you can tap on device and then tap on searching device if it is not connected once it is searched you can tap on watch six and then as you can see it is currently synchronizing the data of the watch once again it's going to ask you for a pair tap on pair now as you can see the watch is connected to your device it tells you what is the firmware version of the watch and also an approximate battery life of the watch which is about 80 percent and if i go here on the watch as you can see scroll from the top is about 80 percent so the watch is connected to the phone and from the phone right here as you can tell it gives you some features that you can use such as take a picture basically using the watch as a shutter button take a picture from your phone if you're alone and then you can also use the watch for bluetooth calling receiving and making phone calls got the search device function which basically searches your watch and gives like a little alarm so if, if the watch is connected to your phone but if you've lost your watch you're not sure where it is you can tap on search device and as you can see it basically has a little alarm and other features right here such as body temperature ecg heart rate blood pressure if you type on dial selection you'll be able to choose different watch faces these are the ones that are pre-installed from the app so now that the watch is fully connected to my phone i'm going to quickly show you guys the features available on this watch so tap once in the middle of the display and then the first thing you'll see right here is basically your messages, notifications. And this one is basically a phone dialer, which you'll be able to call whatever number you want. This is basically your phone book. You can sync your contacts to the watch. This is going to be your call logs. This is basically the Bluetooth connections like I've shown earlier to connect to your device. And this is an app that shows you within the watch how many steps you've done, your blood pressure, the calorie that you've lost, and here's the time. And yeah pretty simple if you swipe up you've got history you've got a goal that you can set and this one i believe is your email notifications this app right here will basically be your blood pressure sensor and let's see if it does calculate so it tells me that i'm having about 74 beats per minute if i'm correct and yeah that's pretty much it once again um do not use this device as a medical device it's not going to be accurate and here's going to be the sleeping mode which calculates the heart rate see when you wake up when you sleep and during the night and then here is basically the brightness of the display currently it's the max which is five then this is the sports modes we got different sports that you can do like walking um outdoor running climbing cycling basketball baseball ping pong you can also use the digital crown to move between the choices, the options. If you tap on walk, for example, tap on go, it sets up a three second um, timer. And then here you've got some information like uh, the stopwatch. And then if you scroll up, you can see that this is gonna calculate your heart rate. This app's gonna calculate your blood pressure. Then this, the oxygen level. Once again, the oxygen level is only available on the Apple Watch Series 6. So to have this feature on the Apple Watch Series 6 clone for one tenth of the price, don't expect it to be accurate. And this is to control your music. So I'm going to show it to you guys right now. You'll be able to control the music and switch between the songs. You can also pause the music. You got the title right there. So there's one thing I found out about the Bluetooth music control on the watch that I really like. I'm not going to show you with the actual music due to copyright, but instead I'm going to play a video from my channel. So I'm currently on YouTube, as you can see. So if I do play and I go to my watch, I can actually pause the video, as you can see, which is pretty cool. So you're not only able to pause the music, but you can also pause like a video or movie on Netflix or on YouTube. The other thing, which is spectacular, let's say I'm actually playing a music and not a YouTube video, and I'm actually on my watch, I tap on play, and then as you can see, it does actually play. If I do tap on plus, you can see that I'm actually playing the audio from the watch. So once again, I'm gonna continue playing. I'm gonna put my phone away. To the real ones. So on the left side is 
it's going to be the Surpolis version 4.5, and on my right side is going to be the real AirPods Pros. Both products are currently in the box. Now, I already unwrapped the plastic packaging of these two in the individual unboxing. So that's pretty cool. So I'm actually able to listen to music from the speakers of the watch. So that is an amazing feature that I've never expected. So the next feature on this watch is going to be a calendar. Then here is going to be an alarm feature to wake yourself up. And then this is going to be a stopwatch. So the next feature is going to be find my phone. Doesn't matter if you have an iPhone or an Android device as long as the watch is connected to Bluetooth of your phone and also the app is opened in the background. Tap on start, as you can see. Then we got the body temperature, which I'm not going to show you guys right here. And the settings, we got two games, which is Ninja Climb and Top Gun. So let's try Ninja Climb. Start game. So we actually have two games that you can play and watch on the go. You can increase the volume using the digital crown. Not sure how to actually play. Okay, I actually died already. And then we got the second game, Top Gun. Start game. Yeah, basically shooting the other ones. Definitely for $30 if you want an Apple Watch Series 6. Um, clone, lookalike, perfect one to one clone. This is pretty much a great clone. It does have uh, pretty much a lot of features. Once again, I do not recommend this to be used as a medical device, but if you want to see how it looks on your hand, if you want to watch, if you want a smart watch, if you want to be able to look at the time, to see how many steps you've done, if you're going on a jog, to be able to control the music from your phone, to be able to listen to music, from the watch and other small features which you won't use like the calculator battery life should last around maybe two to three days if you're constantly using it once again i'll drop a link down in the description where you guys can check these out for around 30 dollars this is pretty good deal it does have a pretty good display i might be using it since it does have really great design really great build quality and really nice weight you can also add a password to it if you want. Once again, if you guys enjoy watching this video, make sure to give a big thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I got much more videos coming to your way. I got other products to review like Bluetooth headphones with ANC and other earbuds with ANC in transparency mode. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Take